German cruiser Admiral Graf Spee, the notorious pocket battleship of World War II. The Admiral Graf Spee, a German warship nicknamed the pocket battleship by the British, played a significant but short-lived role in the early stages of World War II. This Deutschland-class Panzerschiff armored ship was a formidable force, striking fear into Allied merchant shipping in the Atlantic Ocean. Launched in 1934, the Admiral Graf Spee boasted an impressive design. At 186 meters long and armed with six devastating 28 centimeters, 11 inch, guns and triple turrets, it could outrun most cruisers and overpower them in a fight. Its top speed of 28 knots provided an extra layer of defense, leaving only a handful of Allied capital ships fast enough to pose a serious threat. This combination of firepower and speed made it a nightmare for unsuspecting merchant vessels. With the outbreak of World War II, the Admiral Graf Spee, under the command of Captain Hans Langsdorff, embarked on a commerce raiding mission in the South Atlantic. Preying on Allied shipping lanes, it sank or captured numerous merchant ships, disrupting vital supply lines. The elusive, pocket battleship, became a symbol of German naval power and a cause of great concern for the Allies. The Admiral Graf Spee's dominance wouldn't last long. In December 1939, near the mouth of the River Plate in South America, it encountered a smaller British squadron consisting of the heavy cruisers Exeter, Ajax, and Achilles. Despite being outnumbered, the British ships fought valiantly, inflicting significant damage on the German raider. Following the Battle of the River Plate, the damaged Admiral Graf Spee limped into the neutral port of Montevideo, Uruguay. With limited repair options and facing the threat of a reinforced British fleet, Captain Langsdorff made a controversial decision. Fearing a lopsided defeat, he ordered the scuttling of his ship on December 17, 1939. The scuttling remains a debated topic, with some praising Langsdorff's actions as a way to avoid unnecessary bloodshed and others criticizing it as a surrender. The wreck of the Admiral Graf Spee lies partially submerged off the coast of Uruguay, a haunting reminder of the early battles of World War II. The ship's story, marked by both success and controversy, continues to captivate historians and naval enthusiasts alike.